Hello everyone, it's Ishmael and here and I welcome you to today's quick video. Listen, it is very important to listen very carefully when God says, do this. With Abraham, he gave a simple instruction that get out of the place you are at when he called Abraham from Haran. And said, go to the land which I'm going to show you. Forsake, leave everyone, your family and everything else behind. Please note this. I've seen people in the past saying that God has told me to go there to relocate and all. And still there are some who refuse to relocate. Allow me to come with a prophetic word today that yes, it is important to relocate. The Bible makes it clear on how Abraham was not blessed where he was. God needed him to, re to relocate first and then when he could take in, be taken to another area. The Israelites had to be taken out of Egypt in order to be taken to Canaan. As much as sometimes you might be where you at and be like, Lord, bring my Canaan exactly where I am. The Lord wants you to move. Some workplaces, they're just toxic. God has a better place for you. Don't be scared to move. As much as you might look at it and be like, Lord, can't you make this? Can't you promote? God knows he has a better position for you. God knows that only when you go there, that's when it's going to happen. And when you are there, sometimes let me tell you, it's not so easy. It can be challenging. Even Abraham, as he was promised that his descendants are going to multiply, he did not even have a son at the time. No son at all, but he has relocated. It took years until he, he, he had Isaac. But he stayed where God told him to stay. And in the mighty name of Jesus Christ, I come with a way today. Please further pray about this. Trust in the Lord. Ask for a further confirmation. And I'm believing this word is a further confirmation. The Lord will do it where you are. Do not move. Psalms 110 verse 1 says, The Lord says to my Lord, Sit at my right hand until I make your enemies your footstool. Sit at my right hand until. Until. No, no time was given exactly when, but up until you see me do this. So the Lord, when he relocated, when he moves you, it's you wait up until he does what he promised you. And I pray, Father, for you right now in the name of Jesus Christ. May the Lord be for you. May the Lord help you. May the Lord fulfill his promise. In Jesus' name, amen. And of course, that's all I had. See you next time.